I love that there's like four live mm -hmm. aircrafts in your face. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, welcome to Flight Test. I'm Josh and this is Alex. Hey guys. And you know, corporations like Google and Amazon, you might have heard, are working on this delivery system where they're actually going to use drones. Yeah, there's been a lot of hype stuff. in the media about that kind of stuff. Yeah. And Google has that new kind of flying wing. It looks like a quad shot. So naturally here at Flight Test, we want to figure out how it's going to be done. Or if we can't do that, we'll just figure it out on our own, how we would do it. And now Josh Bixler, well really anyone who lives a life uh, with a diet based off of Mountain Dew and coffee, um, might be in need of some breath refreshing gum now and then. So what we tried to do was actually deliver a piece of gum to Josh. Uh, originally Josh just wanted to use the Kraken just like he always does. Mm -hmm. um, but me and Peter said no. We no. wanted the Kraken to deliver drones that deliver drones that deliver drones. Okay. So basically what we did is we took the Kraken. Yeah. On top of the Kraken we had the Electro Hub. Okay. And the Electro Hub was carrying the QAV250 from Lumineer. All right. And then that had a little landing pad on it that was carrying a Proto X, which okay. was carrying the stick of gum for Josh's bad breath. We have to see this. Here goes nothing. Gonna be the longest flight, or the shortest flight. So sketchy. You got it. Or maybe not. I do you want me to like <laughs> run and push it? I think we may need to we do should that. gently do toss that. it though. Just gently toss it. Dude, that, yeah. that'll work. I don't want to be underneath that thing. My kids are watching this. No, don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> I like over the weeds. That's good. Over the weeds? Yeah, like right, right in front you of you, right there. Run right at Alex. Yep. I'm gonna go up the full throttle and yeah, all right. hope for the best. Okay. All right, nice and level. I wanted to get off. I didn't trust it. Let's try that again. <laughs> well, at least we know that works. Yeah. That went well. I saw a pitch way back from this, though. Yeah, did I, did I like, chuck it up? Oh, uh, yeah, so a little softer toss. Just kind of like, forget. I don't do soft. This is barely going to be able to lift. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna run all the way to the weeds right. and then just let it fly out of my hands. That sounds right. better. Cool. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. Full Go. throttle. Oh! Dude, it was flying all right, I Yeah! <laughs> it does work. <laughs> it does work. <laughs> but the, the, the uh, Kraken is underpowered. So in classic flight test fashion, it didn't work the first time? Not exactly. Or the second time? Not exactly. What was the problem? <laughs> it was lack of power. So basically what we ended up doing for a solution was we added a four cell, an extra cell. Okay. Which was kind of questionable because the motors and the ESCs weren't exactly rated for that kind of power, but we figured it would be enough to get us off the ground. So again, in classic flight test fashion, if it doesn't work the first time, do something that you probably shouldn't do. <laughs> Brother? Yep. <laughs> go for it. Oh, man. Define ready. All right, okay. you ready? Yeah, ready to go. All right, spooling up. Woo! All right, we got it. That was way better. It's flying. It's flying. <laughs> We're really doing it. We're doing it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. And I'm gonna take it out the dude. Look at that. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go over top of us. <laughs> Peter, right. one of your Good props idea. is spinning. Yeah, I see it pretty well. <laughs> All right, Peter, you ready right, to try ready? it? Three, go for it, man. Nice! <laughs> <laughs> All right. multi rudders are breeding. All right, so Nick, you have the Lumineer, right? Yep. All right, you tell me when I should scroll up. All right. <laughs> All right, Nick, you ready? Yep. All right, releasing you in three, okay. two, one. Oh my gosh, it's working! <laughs> that is so cool. Nice. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh yeah. I, all right, so Peter has. Now I have the package. He has the package. <laughs> All right, who's launching the little guy? All right, I'll get the Proto X. And the gate is open. Proto X has the gum. Delivers it to Josh, and we have a happy customer. Yeah. yeah. Against all odds, it actually worked. Yeah. We can make drones that deliver drones. That deliver drones. That deliver drones. That deliver gum. 
gum. Yeah. <laughs> That's possible. I, I couldn't imagine why uh, a single drone like the Lumineer couldn't deliver a single package. Sure. So maybe it's not that far off in the future. Hey. Let us know if you want us to dive deeper into this and maybe try recreating the Google, uh, the Wing or Amazon's drone delivery, yeah. some autonomous flight. If you want to see a challenge like that, let us know. Yeah. We want to thank Nick Fredericks from High Tech for coming out to be mm -hmm. in this episode. And we want to thank you guys for watching. And we want to thank Harry's.com for sponsoring this episode. If you go to Harry's.com, you can actually buy online like razors and all kinds of stuff. And if you know someone with an unsightly beard and just looking a little bit scruffy, we don't know anyone like that. No. But if you do, direct them to harrys.com and you can actually, on the checkout, you can use the promo code FLIGHTTEST, F-L-I-T-E-T-E-S-T, -E -E no spaces, and that'll get you $5 off your purchase. Not bad. Yeah. yeah. And it's actually reasonably priced shave products at a fraction of the cost of their competitors. Harrys.com. All right, we'll see you guys next time. See you guys. Josh, open wide. Ah! <laughs> I don't have control. <laughs>